Here we go. Butterscotch. Okay. Shrink Black. Shrinking title. We are mapping out the world. And we're gonna do it with a cartography table. I also wanna like do more work on the base because it's coming along really nicely. But First, I don't need this. So. Grab all of that. I don't have any wood. We should probably get some of that. So we grab the wood, we make a cartography table. And then we make a level three map and we start mapping out our surrounding area. And when that's done, and when that's done, I don't know what comes next, but we do something. We'll probably like run around, do a little bit of exploration. We haven't really done any for a few, months. Mostly just been mining and gathering netherite. Gearing up. Playing the game. I just need one more sapling. Like, one more. Uh, there we are. I'll take it. Okay. Bye. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay. Kind of works out perfectly, though, so we have a stack of wood for whatever we need. Now, uh, the craft table's here. Cartography table acquired. I knew there was a reason we left this open. What? What? Okay, hold on. Do we really need a compass? What? Okay, hold on. I'm actually gonna look at this. Um... this cartography table work? Do we need ink or something? What? Do we really need iron? Well, we have exactly four iron, so this is what we're going to use all our iron on. That's fantastic. Uh, we'll probably need the bed out. 
it's gonna be crazy though. We're gonna actually use our spyglass. Oh wait, I should bring the saddle, huh? Just in case we can find a horse. Venture to the world. I don't know, I wish you could sleep in a bed without setting your spawn. I think I've said that before on stream, but like, I really mean it, man. That's a horse. Wait, uh, how do you exit a boat? How do I not remember this? Do I really have to look at the controls for this? Blah, blah, blah. Slings. Up. Uh, Block. Oh, it should be shift. Okay. I definitely didn't need to look up how to get out of a boat. That's not a thing that happened, ever. Okay. Could have been a cobweb. Just watching out. Like a fast horse, please. No. How the heck do you tame a horse in this game? Did I brought wheat or something? I'll feed them steak. They gotta like steak, right? Okay, listen, horse. Don't trample me. Okay, no, you're slow. Why are you like this? Do you just have to click them with your hand? Why are you going up here? You better not fall off a cliff. You're a different horse. Bruh. It's not very fast. about you? Oh, 
please? If I say please... Okay. I think you're faster. Wait. That's like a two block jump height, you're trash. What's your jump height? Oh, you're even worse. Oh my gods. I found like the most trash horse family in the planet. Oh my gods, you're awful too. You and your middle speed? What? You and your middle speed and your two block jump height is gonna be a gonna have to be good enough for now. I can't be bothered to find another horse, so. Now, I just realized you can make horse armor out of leather, and horses drop leather. So that's, uh, it's kind of morbid. Oh, more horses. That are scarily next to a giant cave. Okay, hold up. Oh, you seem so much faster. Oh yeah, no. Goodbye, idiot. Dude, this horse is banger. Let's go. Okay, another village here. Are there any goods I can, uh, take? A uh, fletching table? We don't need that. Don't mind me. Yoink. Oh, is that a stone cut? wait here don't mind me all right this village is pretty bad but hey we got some stuff out of it oh there's a house up there that may have some stuff How's your jump height, by the way? Ah. Eh. Hello, MA. I got a horse. to adventure. I'm looking for a desert right now. I don't know if my horse says that. Oh, I don't want to follow them with my horse. My horse is beautiful. I don't know. What do we name the horse? Well, I'll think of a name for the horse later.
We go up the mountain. Ruined portal. Alright, horse, stay back. Uh, where's the chest? There's just no chest? Okay, that's cool, I guess. Alright, horse. Oh, we found a ruined portal. We'll come back here later. I can't be on top of you while looking. Okay. They should they should fix that. Like I don't want to be looking at my horse's head. I'm gonna be honest. All right. We are exploring the world. Hopefully, we'll find like a desert or an ice biome. A desert would be great for sand. So bad at jumping, but you're fast, so I forgive you. Huh. There's lava over there. B. Well, I'm guessing you across the ocean. What? Get in the boat, please. The horse can't go in the boat. Okay. Well, guess we're going the long way. Very interesting, though. It's okay, horse. I have feather falling. Jump. Jump. Okay, we need a camp here for the night. Perfect. See, these, this is where I found the original failure horses. That was like 10 minutes ago, but it was a monumentous occasion. So this is the mine. This way is the village. So we cross the river here at the bridge, and then we go on this little peninsula. Hmm. 
Hi, Soul Knight. Okay, we just ride our horse. And we're getting a lot of map coverage very fast. Yep. You made an auto smelter? Nice. Alright, let's cycle back this way. Need to clear up some of that center area. Oh, you okay? Bye, I guess. All right. We head back around. Then I think we have to cycle around to. I don't know where. Very interesting water layout, though. Good for boating. But we'll cycle back around towards the jungle and explore the jungle a little bit. Was almost disastrous. Driving a horse is very dangerous. Um, okay. MA, do you want me to rename the pickaxe? Oh, this is a problem. Rename the pickaxe. Okay. The things I do for this country. Why are you like this? Okay. Let's move. Honestly, I should make another map over here. Just so I have it. Just make one. Oh, I don't have iron. I can't make one. Because you need a compass. In bedrock, you can just put down one piece of paper and get an empty map. Bruh. Java is the inferior version. What is this? Yeah. Block of gold. How do I not have blocks of gold just lying around? I also need to get a lead somehow. Somehow, which means finding slime. I 
Oh my goodness. Okay. You know what? No, we go this way. Wow. Okay, we need to journey this way and see what's beyond the jungle. Because if there's something beyond the jungle, then that's good. Maybe. It depends on how easy the jungle is to traverse. Why is there so much bamboo? There's like a billion bamboo here. Why is there so much bamboo? Bruh, this is awful. So much for being easy to traverse. Let's not go that way. Okay. Holy heck. Okay, horse. We're not going this way. We need to go that way. Honestly, if I could find pandas, I'd be happy. Because pandas are, like, extremely rare. Why is there so much bamboo? It's, like, all bamboo. Why is there just a chicken here? That's a jungle temple. Ah. Uh. Pandas are bears. They're called panda bears. Horse, don't go wandering off. I need you. Back away from the skeleton. I don't know, baby pandas can be vicious. Very dangerous. Okay, um... I need to, like, put my horse somewhere. But, this bamboo is just... Awful.
this will have to do. Strats. All right, they gutted jungle temple chests, and now they're garbage. Should be it, right? No. Is that it? Double saddle though. Okay. I'll take the double saddle. I get rid of put down a random chest. So I, sort of I don't need that. I should probably go home and put away some stuff. Wait, I need the map. Yeah, uh, the sword is a reference to a show I've never seen. So, that's a thing. Ow. Why is bamboo awful? I hate it. I hate it here.
need to get out of here. Why are why is bamboo so awful? Dude, I'm like climbing this mountain and there's just bamboo. I didn't think that I found a bamboo jungle. Oh, that's kind of a steep drop. You can handle it, horse. Go. I heard that zombie. You want some? Ow. Okay, let's go. Do I just like put the horse in here? Do I just like leave him here? Age exercise classes, the bright green outfits. Huh. I mean, I wouldn't know, but. I should have just crafted two fence gates, huh? Well. We explored a lot of the world. We also got two saddles, which is good. And I was blasting jungle temples for having bad loot. Well, my bad, I guess. Honestly, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, having this wall filled out with like an, a 3x3 uh, three three map would be so cool. Anyway. This one trying to flush. I really need to label these things. Oh, I have a sign. This is bones, arrows. I can just like craft a couple chests and then label them. Okay. Um, 
bang. Why is caps lock on? Now I could just like make another item frame too. Because I just have all of this stuff. That's not how you craft sticks. Look at that. That works. I need to figure out how to make a glow squid farm though. We're gonna need a lot of glow ink sacks if we're gonna do that. I also need to make a chest for bamboo. So that means we need more wood. All right, deforestation time. the nether portal from its current spot and just put it over here so it's more easily accessible so I don't have to go all the way down into the depths in order to grab it. Moving the nether portal over here is probably just a smart idea. I could also connect it to like a nether hub. That would be so cool. Um, I don't want to do a raid at that village. You know what? Guess we're doing a raid, boys. Get inside, idiots!
Why are you coming outside? You're stupid. Oh, they're up there. Yeah, have fun with that. <laughs> Let's just watch him for a bit. Oh, here comes one. They're just like prancing around. Why do you keep coming outside? You're just asking to get killed, dude. Buddy. It's like turning to night time. Get inside, idiots. Oh, 
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I have nothing to counter witches. God, dude. I don't even have enough strength. They're all just like camped in there, dude. Why are you on land? I'm just gonna sleep. Hello, Golem. Help me. Thank you. Alright, let me bait the other one.
They're trying. Alright, Golem. This raid is taking ages. Oh. Golem! Are you kidding? Get in!
dude. Can you die already? Oh god. I just need to lure one of them towards me. Let's run. Die already. Can you come down and fight me? You actually killed all my villagers? Why the heck did they leave the doors open? Are you kidding me? Eight waves of a freaking raid. Eight waves. Five iron golems. I lose my. Vi I'm mad. I'm so mad. My shield breaks. I lose all my villagers. And for what? A stupid banner? Three evokers. There's probably a fourth and I just didn't kill it.
God, my armor's wrecked. My stuff is gone. My mending villagers, they're gone. I'm gonna need to go to that other village I found and cart them over here. Dude, oh my god. Full netherite, by the way. What the heck? Yeah, no, I'm never doing that again. Screw the patrols. There's no shot anybody could do that by themselves. What am I even supposed to do? I don't even know what to do now. Well, at least I got iron. I guess. I need a new shield, and I need to enchant that shield with mending, and I gotta redo all the enchanted books, dude. Awful. Absolutely awful. Okay, this time, when we do the village... I don't even know. I spent so long trying to do that, and it's all gone in like 30 minutes. How? I, I don't understand what the game wants me to do. I guess we just bring over villagers and then have them breed and then I guess kidnap them a second time and then give them professions somewhere else so we can like actually harvest them and they'll be protected enough so that a raid won't just come and wipe them out.
There were like five iron golems here. There were like five. I guess I need to have villager professions. Or at least this profession. I, I, that, that's so demoralizing. Gods, dude. Like, why? Why did they leave the stupid doors open? Like, I got concerned when we got to, like, the fifth wave, but I was like, okay, there was an evoker. It'll be over soon. No. No, there were, like, four more. Like, a billion ravagers of whatever. It's like, fine. This wanted me to lose at that point. I was focusing so hard, too. For a minute on the last wave, I was like, maybe I can actually do this. But then I realized that the raid thing wasn't above me anymore, so it meant that something had happened. And I was right. <sighs> I was right. I think I stocked up on mending books, I guess. Those Vex are so killer, though. Uh, I almost died a couple times. I didn't, but... I guess this is why you need a bow. We need to repair our armor. Gods. What was I even supposed to do?
I don't think I'm ready to tote villagers back over just yet. I think, for now, let's just head up to the mob farm. I can't even get glass anymore. find a place to build like the villager housing unit or the trade center that's what it'll be Our armor is almost repaired. It really does repair fast, huh? Yeah. Three of them had unbreaking. Our leggings did. So, I guess that's uh, how that works. Three totems. I mean, I guess some good came out of all that massacre. That's my armor repaired. Shirts. 
guess they aren't lying when they call it Bad Omen. go through a depression arc, we might as well do it while doing something. continue and work our way this way. The rest of this stream is going to be depressing. <laughs> Alright. 
Alright. Here we go. Again. How are the axolotls doing? They spinning. Shred it all down. Horse, what are you doing? No, bad horse. Progress to a raid.
know, I remember saying in the past pretty distinctly that hardcore wasn't for me because it was too stressful. I mean, this is my Minecraft series. I could do whatever I want. I could turn it to easy. If I wanted to. I could turn it to peaceful if I wanted to. I'm tempted, man. I'm tempted. It just... You put in a lot of time to something, and then it's gone in the blink of an eye. But it's like... It feels like there was nothing I could have done, but I know there was something I could have. But I just don't know what. And it's gonna haunt me for a long time. The whole point of the Minecraft series is to be fun. I don't want to have to deal with stuff like raids going on for ages, taking up time and making me just stressed out of my mind. It's a slippery slope though. There's a lot of stuff that, you know, yeah, you gotta make mistakes sometimes. You gotta lose in order to gain. But I'm wondering, is the loss that I'm experiencing gain, or is it simply wasting my time? And I think that's where I need to make my decision. Because if I feel that being on hard is detrimental, to the experience, then what's the point of it, right? I play Minecraft because I love building. I love having the freedom to do these things. I don't want to have to worry. But I think we're getting to the point where It's kind of just frustrating, and it's not really challenging, I think is the thing. Like, obviously I could just change the difficulty whenever I want. And even if I did turn it to peaceful, I'd turn it to hard for the Ender Dragon fight. But, I don't know. This isn't the first sign of hardship we've had, but it's the first major blow to not only my confidence, but my resolve to keep going. I'm going to stick it out for now, but I think if something like this happens again, then I'm going to make a change. Maybe peaceful is a bit too much. Maybe I could just turn it to easy, but well, let's just say I I'd like to build in peace sometimes. I suppose. Also, not having to go to sleep all the time would be really nice. You know what, I'll leave it up to a vote later. For now, though. For now, we'll tough it out.
You know, maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm just upset because the village was something I worked really hard on and it's just gone now. But this stress is a lot. I don't know. What is the point of streaming if, you know, I don't have fun with it? The whole point of streaming this game is to provide a fun, entertaining experience. I'll probably need to think over it. I'm just... It's very emotionally present right now. Look at how much we're able to do just when we don't have to worry. When we have the resources and the gear and there's not a care in the world. It's insane. I mean, I knew doing things like this wasn't my style, but it feels kind of wrong to quote unquote throw in the towel. gonna be struggling with this mental war for a while just uh don't mind me I guess
How does that look? That actually looks good. I like that. I need to clear out a little bit more of this middle or just see it properly, but. It really hurts. It really does. Alright, let's take some of the stone. It's so demoralizing. <laughs> yeah, if you couldn't tell, I'm not gonna get over it, like, at all, for the rest of the stream. say cattail stop whining whining is one of the things i do best i don't know why you're watching this channel if you didn't expect whining so uh it's part of the cattail experience i suppose
bum, bum. Of course. Okay. Please, Butterscotch, I need to get in the chest. I know you want attention, but that's not the way to get it.
Fortune. That's still only one. That's not how fortune works. I'll take everything. And... You know, like my avatar? What? Do you mean like the picture for the uh... The shri- the... Twitch? Or... Do you mean... My character, Minecraft? <laughs> Minecraft avatar? Oh, thank you. I made him like, I made him a bit before I even got Minecraft. I just never used him because I didn't have Java. I don't know. There's something about the very simple face and the candy cane shirt that I made like months ago for Christmas. How long did it take me? All the buildings? Um, what do you mean by those buildings? If you mean this... Uh, this base here, this, it took me, uh, a lot of streams and I'm not done. But if you mean the, the avatar, my cat, there's like a template I have that I just copy off of to make new ones. I don't remember how long the original took. Oh, uh, this base, it's taken a lot of time. Um, granted a lot of that time was spent in the village doing other stuff but it's taken like upwards of, I want to say like 20 hours, maybe? I don't know what episode we're on, and I don't know how much of the streams I spend building the base on average. Definitely more. I don't know. I do, every single thing I do on this file is on stream, except for that one time it bugged out, and uh, didn't show Minecraft for some reason. 
on the Twitch, because Twitch was being lame that day. But, yeah. Every second of this file has been recorded and put on the VODs channel, so. I need to repair this pickaxe, so... Uh, since we don't have easy access to villagers anymore, we're just gonna have to spend like 30 minutes doing something else. Uh, or... Or... Uh, M.A., how do you feel about becoming complicit in kidnapping? jump uh, three feet the ground. See, M.A., I see your point, but at the same time, uh, think about it in Minecraft terms, right? Like, you could just drop down off a cliff if you have feather falling, but you need the elevator anyway to get back up. No, uh, implicit in kidnapping. They kidnap, you would be implicit in Helping me kidnap. Oh, and Butterscotch is coming along too. Because I forgot to make him sit in. Don't worry about it, M.A. It's not like this person has rights. Uh, oh, I just realized on the VODs channel, uh, I'm coming up on that one Uno stream that you told me to edit and cut that one joke out of. So, yeah, I need, I need to remember to do that. Because I need to upload stuff tomorrow. So, yeah, I, I still need to edit that, but... It hasn't been edited yet, and it hasn't been released yet either, so. I made a note to myself in, like, the the uh, description of it. It's like, note to self-edit later. And I just saw it today when I was gonna upload stuff to the VOD channel. I still don't think the jokes were that bad, especially compared to the some of the other stuff I say. But, you know, I respect your wishes. Alright, uh... You. You. How would you like to no longer be a farmer? Well, you're kind of stupid enough, so. D yeah, that's what I thought. We ride. This is what we're doing for the next, like, 20 minutes. We're gonna have to do this again, by the way, because you need two villagers. So, uh, yeah, this is called boating. Oh, if you want to know, I don't know if you were watching when the whole incident happened, why we need new villagers. So you might remember that village we had, right? So, you remember the village we had that we spent, like, hours working on? And, uh, with those mending villagers and everything? Like, trying to get the books? 
and all of that hassle. Well, uh, they all died. So it both was and wasn't my fault they died. So... Uh, there's a little thing called a pillager raid. Basically what it is, is... Butterscotch, please get out of the thing. Where'd it go? That's what I thought, idiot. Anyway, so, uh... Uh, yeah. I also need to kidnap another one so they can give me more villagers. So... Basically what happened is I was I was uh, coming back from exploring the world and there was this random guy called a pillager patrol and he was just hanging out and he tried to kill me so I kill him and then I get a little thing called a uh, bad omen and uh, what a fitting name that is because how that works is that once you go into a village, well, uh, it starts a raid. And then what raids are is it's basically just a bunch of people coming in waves and they're very strong and they're very annoying and they try to kill all your villagers. So, uh, I chalked this up to another one of those updates that mine, uh, that Mojang decided to add that, like, sounds cool, but is not. Don't you dare. What, where are you going? There's stairs there? Go up. Dude, how how do you have the jukes get over here yeah that's what I thought idiot nice try you cannot escape so uh basically so a normal raid lasts around like five waves right like there's some strong enemies here or there. Oh, where's Butterscotch? Butterscotch. You sit. You keep getting in the boat when I don't want you to. Anyway, so they're supposed to have like five or six waves of enemies. They're pretty strong, you know. It's annoying, but it's manageable. Uh, this raid had like eight waves. And there was probably going to be more, but I lost. Because all my villagers died. Oh, and not to mention, I had these giant guys that were, like, there to protect the village called Iron Golems. I had, like, five of those guys, and they all died. Fair and balanced game. So, basically, long story short, uh, all my villagers died, and it wasn't my fault. I got assassin attempted, and then after that, they decided to go kill all my friends because, you know, they felt like it, I guess. Okay, where do we need to go? Uh, this is fine, I guess. So, yeah. Uh, if I'm a little upset about it, and I've been contemplating switching the difficulty for the sole reason of not having to deal with it anymore... Um, well. Oh, where's Butterscotch? Butterscotch is like way back there. Yeah. 
I shouldn't have taken butterscotch with me because it's like a lot of hassle to take a cat around with you. But where's butterscotch? Hey, you're there. Good cat. So, um, yeah. That's why we're kidnapping this guy. Oh, and not to mention all that time we spent refreshing villagers. Yeah, no, that was now for all for nothing. Uh, where are we? We're at the wrong way. Sorry, Butterscotch, we're going this way. You know, I've never played Terraria. I've wanted to get into it, but it seems like such a huge time sink. Yeah, where's the cat? Butterscotch, get over here, please. Thank you. Yeah. It is an NPC, yes. Uh, no, the squid cannot kill me. Butterscotch? Butterscotch? I cannot cook the squid, but I can kill the squid. Yeah. Cat, you're like... Should've left you at home, dude. Okay. I cannot... I cannot eat it. You cannot eat the squid. Butterscotch decides to keep trying to go around the jungle for some reason, so we need to like stop the boat every once in a while so we can get over here. Okay, I'm gonna leave this villager here. I'm gonna take Butterscotch inside. Alright, come on, Butterscotch. Uh, okay, get over here. Stay. Cat, man. Yeah, no, cats don't take fall damage in this game, so... Oh, that's a little long. Um, okay, he's alive. We're fine. Uh, how many cats do I own in Minecraft? On this file, I own four. There's Butterscotch and then three unnamed, one of which is a troublemaker. Exactly help, but I think I need to go this way, wrap around. You know, since the iron golem's died, I can uh, make another map. So that's cool. All right, buddy, welcome to your no home. If I had said like four hundred cats. All right, buddy. Welcome to your new home. Don't die like the last people.
in the water. Get out of the water. There you go. Welcome to the village. Please don't be a disappointment. If you are, then I will murder you. Good job. Welcome to the village. You can have all this. And that. Don't play in the composter. Anyway, uh, we need to go kidnap another one. And then we kidnap another one, and then those two can have kids, and then the village will be repopulated eventually. Like the circle of life and all that. I don't know. Uh. Honestly, I feel like I'd be a good parent. That's a very weird thing to say after I just kidnapped a man, but, um... It is true. I do think I would be a good parent. I mean, for starters, like... I don't know, I... Just like base parenting 101. I, I wouldn't, like, you know, hurt my child. But no pampering them either. Gotta have that happy medium. If I was rich, I would not give my kid money. I'm gonna be honest. You ever hear of, like, those entitled rich kids? like awful terrible people we're like way up here we shouldn't be over here My guys. Oh, that's a Geo. That's cool. No matter what they do, they can. See, it's just like their parents, you know? I mean, their parents don't get in trouble either when they do illegal stuff. So, why would the kids? See, they're learning so fast. Anyway, uh, welcome back to this village, where we will once again kidnap a person. There's like uh, two villagers there. There's another one there. Okay, uh, we want to leave two villagers here just in case, you know, the village dies again. But, you know, if one of you just wants to get in this boat. Ow. I don't think the golem heard me. I 
think we're okay. Okay, bye! I'm not kidnapping the chicken. Chickens are not useful for much in this game. to clear out some of the bamboo in the jungle so I could build stuff there, but... Oh. Chickens are enemy. Okay, so... Uh, here's a little backstory on cattail time. So... Uh, when I was a lot younger, like kindergarten young, my brother and I played Minecraft for the first time. And at the time, I really liked pigs. So I was just like, okay, I'm going to devote myself to the pig and I'm never going to eat pork in this game. Also, in real life, ham tastes awful. Don't eat it. It's garbage. I'm not even like religious or anything. It's just... It just tastes awful. Anyway, so I aligned myself with the pig, and my brother aligned themselves with the sheep. We became the pig empire and the sheep empire. So that was a thing we'd do. And we'd just have fun with that and mess around and stuff. Giant battles were always my brother's thing. I He would rope me into it and it was fun, but like, it also... Yeah. So... Uh, that's where my pig thing comes from, but uh, adding on to that, more recently, uh, I've been moving away from, like, wanting to be in a massive dictator, you know, as you do, so the pig empire was reformed into the pig republic, also piglins are now a thing, so that's cool. The faction just got a lot stronger. And then... Yeah. No. P pigs are just awesome in this game. They, like, don't do much, but you can ride them. If you have a saddle. So that's cool. This villager's also, like, gonna hate me. But who cares? They're gonna work for me now. It's not slavery if I pay them money. So, yeah. Cattail backstory time. That's no. M A. Where do you come up with these ideas? Why do you like this? I don't know about random MA, it's like, your brain is just very strange with the direction it decides to go in. We'll put it that way. Okay, so our other villager was here. And now... To land with you. What? Where are you going this way? Go that way. There. See, look at that. They're already best friends. 
You're still a jerk. So, yeah. I just realized I could just do this. And they just take it because they're dumb like that, I guess. Hey, you guys want some bread? Have some bread. I don't remember where I left my other crafting table. You didn't throw the bread in there, did you? Anyway. So now the plan is, is that we just throw a bunch of bread at them. Somehow I knew where that thought was going, and I was still, like, I had a shred of hope, M.A. I had a shred of hope. Take some bread. Are you gonna... Oh, one of the iron golems did live. He's a failure. Anyway, um... Dude. He's just not gonna... You did fail your people. And they all died. But you have a second chance. Be free. Okay. You are free. Soul failure, though. Yeah, no, the Iron Golem, they're scary, but they're friendly. As long as you don't, like, kill people. So, yeah. Anyway, we have our uh, farmers back. So, basically now, we just wait for them to get enough bread to start having kids, and then... So, once they have children, uh, we're gonna do a little bit of a thing called, uh, deportation. I'm making all the dark jokes today, what's going on? Anyway. So, uh, yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna move the villagers to a second location. And, uh, you know... But we'll employ them there, so they don't die in case of a raid. You know? Because I don't want to lose all my guys to a raid again. Because that felt garbage. Like, really garbage. I cannot stress enough how garbage it felt. Oh, we still need to repair our pickaxe, so, uh... Anyway. Bruh, okay. This always annoys me. I have like three sound effects in here. And like sometimes they get played. It, it just annoys me, dude. The next one won't even be for the rest of the stream. Okay. Uh, back to this though.
Uh, we need iron, and we need one piece of bricks. Now we also need paper. Where did I put the paper? Saddles, paper. So, actually, first we do this. Make a compass. So here's the thing, you put a compass, and you surround it with paper, and you get a map. And if we run over here, to this far side of the base, with a little luck, it will be a different map than the one we have currently. Yes, it is. So we're not going to keep it this size. Now what we're going to do instead... As we go back over... Oh. Okay. And then... Uh, does this match the scale? Hold on. I, I actually need to test this. Uh, where's the leather? Leather. Stick. No, it's not even close. Okay. Boom. Wow, this horse is bad. Wow, okay. Okay. Watch where we're going. That's that's a lesson I need to learn, probably. Just to watch where we go. I'm hoping we can find a desert or a snow biome. Just looks like a lot of mountains. And a lot of plains and a lot of savannah. We got a lot of savannah in this one. Okay, it's not a thunderstorm, we're okay. Um, I see flowers. Interesting. Oh, look at that, another village. That we can, uh visit if we need to. Oh, that's a blacksmith. Okay. A 
Is that also a blacksmith? I think that's also a blacksmith. What do we got in here? There's... Oh, I already raided this village, didn't I? Well, that's, uh... Oh, that makes sense, actually. It speaks to my strength of character, I suppose. Not that, that my character is nice, but that I have a consistent character. Oh, that, that's alright, MA. It, it's like 11.30. That's pretty late. Thanks for sticking around as long as you did, though. And see you next time. You know, I don't know why it shows up as red on the map when it's clearly orange. Justice for the color orange, please. some tall mountains. I guess I already took it. Yo, horse. No. Yes. What? Where, where are we? Okay. Oh, that's dangerous. Okay. Let's avoid the pitch black cave.
All right. This exploring stuff is fun. Crawl forward. Lied. No horse, go. I really need a name for you. This is pretty dope. I would like to find another biome. God, dude, that freaked me out so much. Okay. Looks like that's gonna be a giant mountain. I kinda wanna go home. After that Enderman jump scare? Yeah. I need to build another bridge. Why is there an Enderman right there? Keep my head down. All right, we're back home. I'd say we cleared out a good portion of the map with minimal jump scares. Okay, looking at this map, it looks like the ocean is up there. Um, it looks like there's more plains to that way and that way. This looks to be jungle area. This is savanna. Huh. Oh, right, horse. Okay. 
Okay. I need to repair this thing. I'll guess what we're doing for the next 10 minutes. No. Get off the chest, troublemaker. And find to the corner with you. Um, yeah, let's go, uh, let's go kill some mobs. So those two farmers should be enough to get me money. goes like so fast for so long and then it just doesn't well soon it will be done soon I wasn't expecting the raid today I'm gonna be honest Alright, I need to pay attention. And I still need to make that shield. But I guess it can wait. Especially since we're going like exploring now. May want to find build sites for other things. Like the villager trading center. Or the VTC for short. I don't know if that's an acronym already, but if it is, that's highly unfortunate. I definitely forgot the card. Yeah, I think we'll go until this pickaxe is... Yeah, until both pickaxes are done. I, I should probably just do this one first. Just so we can have, like, an actual time frame here. But, yeah. Honestly, this is probably the most demoralizing stream I've done, like, ever. But it's also made me more determined to do things right next time. And I think that's important. Failure is a part of the experience. Experience. Yeah. Of course, dying isn't nice, though. Honestly, despite the major setbacks this stream, we made some progress. I did what I wanted to do, which was start mapping out the areas. You know, for all the flack that I give, gave the raid and its difficulty, I definitely made for the most interesting experience. I've not been drinking enough water this stream. I don't even know what happened to my water bottle, to be honest. 
I like carry a water bottle every time I go to stream because hydration is important. I have no idea where it went. Oh, there it is. There, there it is. We're good. You know, there's baby zombies, why aren't there baby skeletons? Like, that's, that should be a thing, right? song list. Do we have any bangers coming up? Yes. I'm gonna move this one up just because it's banger. Okay. That one... the unknown is like, dude there's so many bangers just like right here I know it's weird like on one hand I'm calling my own songs bangers but on the other hand it's like the fact that I do that for only some songs and not others it's kind of funny oh those were pants a new moon less mobs that's unfortunate honestly if they added the blood moon so that like every full moon has like a one in 100 chance of being a blood moon and just summoning like insane amounts of mobs that'd be funny if a blood moon only activated once you killed the dragon, I think that would probably be better. But out there goes a spider. What are the red particles? Like strength? of healing for me. Also, that carrots potatoes ratio. Look at that.
Wham. A lot of zombies in this one. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's still not a lot of riding flesh. I mean, like, not like we'd use it for anything, so.
telling me that the lyrics on the spot seem extremely hard, so I watch them go online won't make sense. the last song, so... Also, this part's like my favorite part of any extended song.
Alright, now I'll just walk these things back over, take a nap, and we will be good. Really need those glow item frames. Alright. Ah. Uh, I think this is where we end it. It's definitely been one of the longer streams. That's us. That right there. We're probably right there. Ah, probably right there. But that's us. And you know what? Despite the raid, I think I had a good time, and this was a good stream. 
See you next time.